Charlie Whiting was a giant personality in Formula One. Over a career in motorsport that spanned 50 years, he became F1's go-to guy for driving safety, for technical and sporting regulations, and for the teams and drivers themselves. He was that rarest of characters, universally liked, hugely respected. He operated with a lightness of touch and easy sense of humour that belied the gravity and importance of his role as one of the most influential people in Formula One. His first job in Grand Prix racing came as a mechanic at Hesketh before he moved to Brabham in 1978. By 1981, he'd been made chief mechanic, winning the world title with Nelson Piquet in his first year, and again in 1983. His team regularly flirted with the letter of the law as regarded the regulations, a skill which proved especially useful when Whiting moved to a new job with the FIA after the 1987 season. With an eye for technical detail, his star rose quickly. He was made technical delegate in 1990, and over the next almost 30 years, until his sudden and tragic passing, he was at the forefront of the technical direction of Formula One. His role developed over time to include race starter, and he would eventually come to be named race director. He was deeply involved in the constant search for improved safety in the sport, not only in Formula One, but across categories worldwide. While attempts were made over recent years to plan for his eventual succession, it quickly became obvious that no one person could fulfill the myriad of roles and responsibilities that Whiting took on and mastered with such ease, wisdom and humour. His loss is incalculable to measure in the sport that he loved and which loved him. <laughs>